anti-Brexit campaigner confronted with 30 polls with majority rejecting second referendum. Our Future Our Choice co-founder Femi Alul claimed latest polls suggested British voters now want a chance to have a say on the final Brexit deal. BBC Sunday Politics Sarah Smith however shot his claims down bringing up a telling graphic pointing out the surveillance poll he quoted was just one of three showing a surge in support for a people's vote. M. Smith said, well, we've got a graphic where we can show you the answer. We'll bring that up right now and we can have a look at the number so you can see. That poll you referred to, the surveillance polls, showing 48% supporting a second vote. The most recent one before that had a majority opposing that. The BBC host continued, We've had a look back over 30 polls in the last 18 months, 24 of them were against another vote, 3 were for. It doesn't seem as though you have convinced the public that they want to go for this again. The surveillance polls conducted for Good Morning Britain found that 48% of the 1,022 respondents now want to vote on the final Brexit deal. The survey also found that 43% back a soft Brexit compared to 37% urging the government for a hard break from the bloc. Mr. Alul defended his stance in favor of a vote on the withdrawal deal saying British voters should have a say on the ultimate destination. He said, We have this idea that people can't change their minds. If people have been watching this Brexit process, they've seen the EU set the terms, they've seen that our own cabinet can't decide amongst themselves. Of course opinion have changed as to whether or not the ultimate destination is going to be in favor of the British people. People are saying that they want back into this debate. Mr. Alul's campaign backed a mass anti-Brexit protest in London that saw thousands of Remainers take to the street to pressure the government into holding a second vote.